Hey, welcome back to Cool Kids Art and let's draw Drift's new dual edge pickaxe. So let's get started with a quick sketch and then I will show you line by line on how you can draw this. Alright, so let's draw this and to begin we're gonna draw in the handle. So we're gonna draw it in an angle because we're gonna draw two of them. So we'll just draw basically a long rectangle, slightly slanted. Okay, and then from there we'll draw in, let's draw in the, the very end of it first. We'll just extend it, draw a little box on the end. So let's go back up and draw the blade. So right here, I'm just going to extend it. And then we're going to go up with the same slant as this. So it's a little bit tricky, you can use a ruler if you like. And just draw basically a long rectangle with this end open. Okay, and then once you get to here, on this part, we're going to curve out. And then on this part, we're going to go all the way up. So we're going to curve it all the way up like this. And it was a very strange shape. And then once you have these uh, two corners here at this point, we're going to draw one nice curve connecting, connecting them. Okay, very tricky curve to draw. All right, and then from here, um, we're going to continue this here, this line. Just come up here. I'm going to draw one little line here all the way up. And then once you get here, we're going to curve, go all the way to the, uh, the very tip there. So just kind of keep curving and tapering in. All right, so that's the hardest part. And now we can draw in the little details. So right here, come out, go all the way out, come down and just close it off like that. And then in here is some more detail. So this is actually going to be different material. So I'm going to come up here, just draw a little slant. So this is going to be one, um, kind of like a silver material. And then we're going to draw another one up here. Okay, so that's another material. And then there's going to be two more stripes up here. That's going to be one and then two. And we'll be able to see them better when, when we color them. All right, so I know it's a lot of little lines there. It gets a little messy. And then let's come back up to the, uh, I mean, come back down to the, uh, the handle here. So it's got those little wrappings. So I'm just gonna draw like a little diamond shape. One on the top, one on the bottom here. And then I'm gonna draw one more in the center. And then in between those, I'm gonna draw one more. Just trying to get some even spacing on this. Okay, and then for the uh, the little chain here in the bottom, so we're gonna come up here, just draw like a little bracket, come out, come back into the chain, and then inside we just draw, pretty much uh, giving this loop this line some thickness here, and then for the chain itself, we we'll just kind of keep it simple, just come down, just draw a little rectangle first. And then we'll come here, draw a smaller one. And then same thing here, just one more but longer. Okay, and then from this little one here, we're gonna, we're gonna bracket this. So we'll come up here, just draw like a little bracket around it. So that's gonna be one link. All right, so we'll just leave it like that and now the tricky part is to draw in the other one because it's really hard to get something symmetrical. But let's just go ahead and try it. Um, right here, we're gonna draw the handle, so it's gonna be going this way. Let's draw like a little rectangle, same size as this. And then we're gonna keep coming down here. And then for the bottom again, just extend it. 
draw like a bigger rectangle. And then now let's come up here. So we're going to extend this. And then again, same thing. Go up. So this part is tricky because you kind of have to use the other side for reference to see how far out to go. All right, and then from here, curve. And then this part is very tricky. So we're gonna draw one big curve going up using the other side as reference. So for me, it's easier because I sketched it. So you might wanna sketch this as well because it's really hard to draw something symmetrical. All right, and then from here, same thing. Just one big curve coming down. Okay, so now we're gonna draw this line here. So right around here, just extend it, come up. Once we're here, then we're gonna go up. Just kind of taper it all the way to the corner. Okay, and then it's gonna go out, all the way out. Just come back with a little hook. Okay, so same thing here, these lines. So we're gonna come up, draw one line, and then draw one more. And then up here, we're gonna draw two bars, so same direction. So one, two. And then for the wrapping as well right here, same thing, just a little diamond shape. So one here and then one on the bottom. And I'm just gonna draw one more here. Okay, and then for the chain lane itself, same thing, just come out with a little bracket. Another one on the inside. And then now come down. So use the other side for reference. So that's one smaller one and then one longer one and then a smaller one we just bracket around it and that is it for this dual edge hope you guys like the way it turned out and if you do please do give me a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't and i will see you next time